Hi everyone, Jason from Makera here with another Makera Cam tutorial, and in this one we're talking about layers. Layers are part of the functions panel over here, and they allow us to separate our design across different layers where we have different objects in different places. Now by default, you'll always have layer one created whenever you make a new design, and this is our active layer. What that means is whenever objects are created or copied or pasted, like for example, if I create a circle, that object was created onto the active layer. Now I might wanna separate my design across layers so we can right click and insert a layer and we'll see that a new layer was created and that is now set to be the active layer. And if I go to create a circle now, that is created on the new layer. Now you can select objects even when the layer isn't active. So this blue circle is part of layer one. I know that because layer one is set to be blue, while this green circle is part of layer two. And I can easily select this blue circle from layer one even though I'm not on that active layer. But let's say I copy and paste this blue circle. We'll see that it doesn't paste to layer one where I copied it from, it pastes to the active layer. Now you can always rename the layer if you'd like. So I can call this layer two instead. You can also adjust the color of the layer or the objects on that, the color of the objects on that layer if you'd like. And you can always delete a layer. You cannot delete your active layer. So if you'd like to delete the active layer, you actually first need to set yourselves to a new active layer or another layer, set that to be active by right clicking and clicking active. So I can do this and then you can delete it. Anytime we import an object or a graphic, for example, if I import a vector graphic file, you'll see that that is imported to a its own layer. And another benefit of working in layers is you can easily hide layers, so you can only be looking at a single part of your design. You can also easily select things across an entire layer by right-clicking the layer and clicking selecting graphics like this. And you can always reorganize the order of your layers by moving them up and down in the functions panel as well. It's also important to note that these layers are all part of this work coordinate system or our default work coordinate system number one. If I were to make a new work coordinate system, that would have its own selection of layers as well. There's plenty of times where your entire project might be on a single layer, and then there's other instances where you might want to break up a complex design across several layers. Either way, you have the layers panel here to support you as you design and create incredible things.